Sisters at Jerusalem, James K. Baxter. I will now read an extract from this piece, followed by the Lilburn piece, and I will then read my response to Baxter Midway. If heaven gives me this old house by a river, it is not for myself, but for the purpose of peace. As the thunder and rain of spring make things green again, a fence of poplar leaves between us and the hill who is our mother, or the chestnuts we gather in autumn where the earth is where again. In our dreams it may happen that the dead return again, as if the earth spoke to us, because time is a river on whose bank in ignorance the tribes gather with emblems of battle yet desiring peace. The fathers instruct us from their holy hill so that the warrior soul may awaken. In winter, with a heavy wind, I wake and wait for the sun to lift the fogs again that binds Jerusalem like a bridegroom above the hill. He touches the blades of fire, the waves of the river like the body of a woman. Our words, our words are of peace in this house where the wounded children gather. Peace is the language of the punga on the hill, not growing from any gain. These images I gather as eels waken in the darkness of the river. The times are like some rough and roadless hill I have to climb. I do not hope to gather peers in the winter or halt the flow of the river. Nat berries and sludge the souls of who begin to waken and know themselves. Our peace can't patch again. That canoe is broken, yet all men value peace. Tēnā koe, Mr Baxter. Or may I call you James? Dear James. In our dreams it may happen that they visit. Time is a river and we, stones forged from our earth mother, lay. Carried with the current ebbs and flows as life wraps over us, around us. The warrior soul never slept, James. Displaced, perhaps. Dormant, perhaps. I think you would be proud, for today she has risen. Ancient vibrations through the eyes of the children, trickling off the tongues of their mothers, callous on the hands of their fathers, as they carve kurauarako, just as their fathers' fathers once did. We still gather with emblems of battle, James. We still desire peace. We still hikoi barefoot along the rough and roadless hill. We still climb, we will climb. Our souls begin to waken as we know ourselves. Yet our peace can't patch again. Broken not be the canoe, but perhaps a part of us. Peace is still the language of the ponga on the hill. Gain still a noxious growth winding up its trunk. The wounded children still gather, James. We found ourselves through each other. They have forgotten the hill is our mother. The fruits of her labour now are trade to be bartered and no longer her love. We still value the peace you speak of, James. Yet the journey towards enlightenment is taking some time. Heaven has now given you your house by the river. Not for yourself but for the purpose of peace.